Um, that could be a problem. <laughs> I don't think they could actually get up from there. Don't worry, fellas, rescue is on the way. Hi. Yeah, you, you guys seem to be a bit stuck. Let me just do that and uh, yeah, you, you can, you can, yeah, there you go. Just don't fall off now. And as a, as a payment, I will go ahead and gladly uh, take some of your carrots and, and wheat as well. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Thank you. you. You can have the seeds and wheat, though. I think I just want the carrots. Thank you. Anyways, with rescue mission completed, welcome back to Feed the Beast Legend of the Eyes. It is a rainy day today, however, that shouldn't affect us much, because before we head on today's adventure, I want to try and craft a few items. However, I was told, I, I, I was confused in the last episode why I couldn't get any, actually I shouldn't eat right now, uh, why I couldn't get my parts further up. But if we take a look at the food in here, you will notice that some of the food has this text on it that says this smells mysteriously unfamiliar, meaning I haven't actually eaten that food yet and I didn't need notice this at all. So to you that told me this in the comments, thank you very much. And if it was multiple people, I don't recall 100%, thank you all. Um, so apparently I haven't eaten all of this raw stuff, which I definitely don't understand whatsoever. Like why would I not have eaten all of this delicious... Ah, there we go. Extra hot. So that makes that that much easier. No, I'm not going to be eating the enchanted gold apple. Anyway, today I think we are going to be taking a little bit of a break from exploring this, the dungeon over here, and I want to explore and find a desert. Yes, we have an HS compass here, and I have set it to detect a biome desert. A biome desert, a desert biome, which is 2,080 blocks away from us, and I want to go there. Mainly to try and find a, if we go into here and then in Eyes of Ender, right here, the Pyramid of the Sands, we should be able to hopefully get an eye from it. I guess we'll have to find out. But before we do that, I do want to craft a few things, one of them being a cage. And you may be asking why? Well, in here we have this capture frog in the cage, and this can then be used to trade with a wandering trader to get the doll eye. So that is definitely something that I want to do. However, oh yeah, by the way, in the last episode, we set up this lovely storage right here. Um, do I have any, do I have, <laughs> <laughs> do I have any iron? I do, but not a whole lot, actually. Oh, wait, I do have a bunch of nuggets. That might have just saved the day. If I can go ahead and make some bars. Yep, I, th I think I have enough if I just smelt these real quick. I also want to craft a few other things, such as the launch box. I'm not 100% sure how this works. However, I think I should just be able to do that. And right click, shift right click this, and we can put food in here. And I think that it'll just like use those foods. So I think what I might do actually is keep foods that I haven't eaten yet in here. Then whenever I'm hungry, I can just hold this and right click, hold down right click and it should be consumed. Now, if I just go ahead and do this, uh, I do need press A on this recipe to save for later. Oh, oh, that's cool. That That's very cool actually. That's very nice. Anyways, let's make the cage, just in case we maybe um, meet a frog or something like that on our journeys, and that is going to be very handy. And we also, we made the launch box, there's also this flute, which in here, tools of the trade, flute, the flute can be used to summon a tamed horse. Don't know when fed to a tamed mouth speed, whoa, okay, horse feed, that, that's a lot. I don't know if I'll actually be able to make this. Um, oh, I, I do have bamboo. Okay, flute. I don't know if it just works like that. We'll test that out later as well. I would also make, like to make a sleep charm, which basically makes it so sleeping happens a lot faster. Right here. And I think I should be able to make it except for the yellow, black, and red wool. Uh, oh, that's a fancy bed. Wow. I would also love to make a warp stone before we leave. However, and the pearls and also purple dye is going to be a little bit of an issue. However, we have a solution for that. So I'm going to take a boat and head into the nether. Hope I don't die and head on over to the warped forest that's over here. Well, hello, we might actually have our first, our first, uh... yep, get in the boat. That you did not go in the boat. You did not go in the boat, sir. Thank you, thank you very much. Okay, 
didn't get anything from that. I do have to be careful of those. You really shouldn't be here, but <laughs> you seem to be all doing all right. So can I play? Yeah, there we go. Perfect. I'm gonna do this and get a few ender pills here. Oh, you might be a problem. You might be a problem. I'm pretty sure someone told me something about these guys that they might drop something. I don't quite recall. Uh, oh, that's another one. Oh, that's actually quite a. F oh, that's okay. That's four. That's four here. That's a lot of them. Hold up, that's a lot. What are you called an end? End? end up? Okay. Okay. I think I got away. Aha! Uh -huh. I think I found it. Warthog shell piece. They may. These guys may drop these. And yep, right there. And we can actually use these to craft netherite scraps. So those creatures are actually very, very useful. However, I don't think I have quite the gear. <laughs> <laughs> to be taking them on constantly and the crossbow is not ideal for that either. Oh, I got one. Oh, no, never mind. That's the meat. Well, I can add that to my thing. Oh, and I can in fact eat right now. Boom. Which one did I eat? Nice. I got one. With almost no health left, but I got one. <laughs> yeah, I definitely need better armor to take them on head on. Either that or a better bow. Alright, I unfortunately did not get another ender pearl during my journeys. It got a little bit too danger dangerous. So I'm going to hold off on that. However, I do want to check out really quickly because we do have a lot of different bows here, some of which are better than normal bows. If we take a look in here and look at this right here. Offer the FTP Legend of the Eyes offers a variation of bows, be sure to check them all out. So we have the Iron Bow for example, does more damage and durability and also faster draw speed. We also have Golden Bow, Crystal Bow, so I think... I don't know if I have enough iron though. I don't. <laughs> uh, maybe I can just make a... maybe I just bring one of these in instead of this crossbow because it doesn't really work that well. Could also make a reinforced bow. Yeah, I think I think I might do that, and I can actually use a a damage bow to make it, so that's good. All right, I'll take it. Nice. All right, with that, let us get to it. Uh, I should be able to just drop down, right? Do I have everything? Do I have? I don't have a bed roll. Do I? Nope. I I don't have a bed in general. Um, bed. Can I make a bed, please? Thank you. All right, now I think I have everything. Let us go. Whee! Okay, that's scary. <laughs> All right, follow the compass. It is set to the desert biome, and we are off. I do wish I had been able to make the warp stone. However, I'm just going to hope that we find some more waystones during our journey that we can pick up and then use later on. I should test out the flute as well, because I don't know if it just spawns in a horse with a saddle and everything, or if I, assu I assume I have to tame a horse first, but let's try. Oh, you do. Okay. <laughs> All right, onwards. Oh no, we might have a problem. We 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 may have a problem here. Um, my horse cannot swim. Oh, I do see a village over there. Hold on, I think we can go around. Ooh, and a lot of flowers. A lot of flowers. I do actually want to quickly grab a few roses. Might become useful later on. This biome is very, very peaceful. I love it. Yep, that's another village. Meaning as well, another waystone and potentially more loot. I don't think I'm going to teleport to this village, so I think I'm just going to bring this waystone with me. And yes, someone commented, glowstone can be found under the waystones. That is indeed correct. Very well noticed, because I didn't. <laughs> Ooh, we have some stuff in here. Ooh. Emeralds, yes, I will take this. Onions? Tomato seeds? I mean, I do have a backpack, so we should... I should be able to... Eh. Put everything in here? Yes. Perfect. I'm just quickly going to look through this village, see what is useful and what isn't, uh, because this is not our final destination, so I just want to look through this place real quick. Oh, wait a minute. I saw something in here. Yes. Cartography table. That is going to be useful. 
to get a specific trade that will lead us to hopefully a woodland mansion which could potentially lead us to another ender eye i do say another even though i haven't actually gotten one yet so yeah th hopefully we'll get one very soon oh wow this chest was loaded that was a lot of stuff very very nice let's get back here Ooh, blacksmith coming in with the big win <laughs> Two diamonds and extra items and everything. Okay, very, very nice. Thank you, good sir, for your donation towards our epic quest of finding all the eyes. What? Okay, those are horses. Good. Now, we do have to go in that direction. However, I saw in the distance over here something a little bit weird. I'm not going to say very weird, but a little bit weird. Yeah, that looks man-made. Oh, wow, that's big. Oh, wow. Um, is that... Okay, that's tree. Not good. Okay. We, we have spawners here. I think I'm going to note it down. Can I... I Waypoint? Way, waypoint. Can I can I add... Waypo add waypoint. Yes. Huge dungeon. Yes, because I definitely want to come back to this. But for now, our mission is clear. I want to find that desert. That is one thing with this mod pack. I really love exploring and I really want to continue exploring, trying to find all the eyes and whatnot. But I also want to get into some of the... Oh boy. Some of like the, the tech mods. There's a tech mod and some other things as well I really would like to get into. But then I wouldn't be exploring. And I want to explore, but I also want to get... <laughs> it's hard to find balance. So I'm going to do the best that I can. I see another village. And some floating... Oh. Oh, we have another... Oh, that's another very big dungeon over there. Huge dungeon again. <laughs> so if the first one is good, then we might come back for this one as well. Again, just gonna quickly... Ooh, just gonna quickly go through this place, see if we got anything useful. The compass might actually be useful. That might actually be useful. Or don't you run away. I don't think I'm gonna take this waystone. I already have one. That's really my primary concern. So I think one is going to do. Maybe I wanna teleport back here at some point. Aha! Uh -huh. Ruined portal. Now, horse, don't you walk into this. This is for professionals only. Uh, what do we have here? Ooh, a gold knife. Okay, I'll take that as well as a glittering melon. And obsidian. Don't think these are going to be of any use. I will grab this real quick. Just so I can get that golden block over here. Because I will need that. Thank you. Uh, horse, where did you go? There you are. In fact, let us sleep for the night. Good night. I love the ambience as well. Really, really do love it. Oh, what the... What, what's the... Whoa. Okay. Sparse jungle. I wouldn't... <laughs> this is full-on jungle. Wow. All these trees. Okay, then. We are 500 blocks away from a desert. This place is beautiful. Another floating village. And a tower. Okay. I mean, at least we see it on the map, so I don't need to put a waypoint on everything. Just the things that I might look look back on and be like, hey, eh? <laughs> what was that? I don't actually sound like that when I'm confused. Okay, maybe sometimes we, we won't talk about this topic. What we will talk about while I am fighting to get my horse over to the other side is if you haven't subscribed yet and you are enjoying the content here on the channel, well, make sure you subscribe and enable those notifications as well. It helps out the channel a ton and also leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Go away, satellite. Uh, yeah. Okay, this is not... This is slowly becoming not horse-friendly territory. I'm actually managing to get this horse <laughs> onto the treetops to get through the jungle. That is epic. Oh, what do we have here? Oh, that's a creeper. That's a creeper. Please go away. Oh, that's an, asa that's an azalea tree. Azalea. I need to mark it down. Hopefully there's no creeper in the area. Azalea. Is, is that how you spell it? I hope so. <laughs> I'm stressed. Creeper in the area. All right, we're definitely getting close. Oh boy, I might have to... That's a drowned. 
I, I thought it had a trident. I might have to leave you here, horse. And come back for you. Actually, I'm going to find out what happens if I summon you on the other side of this. Because getting you... No, no, I can't leave him. He's been through this entire journey. He has been through this entire journey. I cannot leave him just like that. I don't know if the flute will summon this horse or a new horse. But, not risking it. This horse is going to make it ugh, to the other side to get to this desert. And we have made it. And made it we have indeed. And we have found what I was hoping for. I think anyway, a pyramid. Right there and man this place is bright yep that oh i didn't even notice this uh, uh -huh. oh oh dear M maybe i'm not prepared for this <laughs> uh maybe i'm not prepared for this um right i do want to check out the Ooh. okay oh wow wow oh wow hold up horse stay right there Okay, now that is pretty. Can't deny that. That is epic. That's iron. I can't need iron. Wow. Okay, this place is cool. However, this worries me a little bit up here. Um, horsey, you are not done yet. <laughs> How does one enter this place? I may very well and very quickly find out that I am not suited at all to go into this place. But we're gonna find out. I'm trying to find the official entrance. Hold up. Okay. I think I know what that is, but we'll get to that. Right, well, I guess one way of entering is oh dear. I did hmm. I didn't think this through, did I? Do I have I do not have a bucket of milk on me. I'm just gonna have to wait. I, and I assume as soon as this is gone, it's going to reapply. Yep. It it just went up. Okay, well, I am kinda prepared for this. And by prepared, I... Hold on. Is that a hole at the top? By prepared, I mean something just came to my mind. Oh! Well, that's one way of going down. <laughs> uh, right, I'm going to put this right here. I'm going to call this desert uh, pyramid. I, I hope that's how you spell it. Let's just double check. I, I need to double check. You don't. I mean, you can as well, but pyramid. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah, perfect. And now it's raining, I think. Ugh. The place all of a sudden became very, very scary. Right. Flute. Go in backpack. Aces compass. Go in backpack. I don't have a bucket of water. So I'm going to head home real quick. Just like that and get properly prepared. What I was going to do if there wasn't a big hole at the, in the ceiling, I was going to use TNT. Also, I do believe that this onion is all I need to eat in order to get a second brand new heart. Anyway, I will do that when I'm actually hungry. Horse is still here. We're going to go down. This is either going to be really good or really bad. Oh boy, here, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Going down, and we're going down. F Whoa, this place is big. This place is... This place is big. This place is big. Ve very big. Why do I feel like there's going to be some weird, creepy... Oh, there's gonna... There's gonna be puzzles down here, aren't there? Alright, well... Huh. Four... One to four... Three... Okay, I don't know what that means. Okay, yeah, there's... There's bad guys here, alright. Alright, well, let's see what is in... Ooh! <gasps> we got our first eye! Lady! You have been cursed. Kill the pharaoh to lift the curse. What's the curse? You've gained an additional heart. Okay, that's amazing. And I should gain another one right now. Yes, good. Okay. Don't know where the pharaoh is. <laughs> but guys, we got our first eye. I'm cursed. <laughs> 
but we got it. We got it, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, don't know what the curse does if... Okay, what on earth is this? Okay, wow. Uh, I'm very confused. So, back up. Th thank you. I may need that. Right, this back here is essentially just one big maze. There's clearly stuff below me. What's here? Uh... Right. Don't don't know what don't know what any of that means. <laughs> don't know what any of this means. That's up. I guess these might be the towers, I suppose. I guess that's only one way to find out. There could be bad guys up here. Gotta be aware of that. No, this just goes around. There's stuff in here. There's stuff in there. Hold up. There's stuff right in there. But I'm minor fatigued, so I can't I can't break it open, which might be a good thing. Oh, one of them made it down. Hey, buddy. At least I'm not that scared of the husks. Okay, what happens? Whoa, hello. I didn't, I clearly didn't get that right. I clearly did not get that right. Okay, um, bear with me while I take care of this. Which, by the way, is a pain. This pro is probably trapped as well. Yeah, like I was saying, this, by the way, is a pain with minor fatigue. Right. Alright, I need to somehow destroy this spawner. Even though I have minor Oh, I can't destroy it. Oh, I can't... I can't pick it. Okay, I think I might just have to go down. And see what happens. I, I want to press the buttons on that. I want to press the buttons on that. Hold on. Hold on. I hear fire as well. What does this do? Uh, oh, it's a path. Okay. Uh, right here. One, two, there. All the way over here. Up. And over. Don't know what this does. Maybe I broke something. Well, now it's back. Okay, let me try this again. Go here. This to here. All the way over. Like this. And then... This way? I'm a bit confused. You guys will have to let me know how to sort through this down in the comments. I am not good with puzzles. Right. Let's go down. Uh, I really did want a few more torches. Wait a minute, where did you guys come from? I want a few more torches, but I think... Oh! Oh! Okay, I do, I do need to get going now, guys. Alright, going. Going. Okay. Uh, this looks interesting. Oh, if I had flint steel, I could light this stuff on. Ooh! <laughs> I could light this up on, on. I could put it on fire. And block of rock old. I, okay, I will take this when I have defeated. Okay. I'm going to go up. I need more torches. I need more torches. And I want the flint and steel. Oh, but I'm cursed though. I don't actually know what that means. We're going to find out. Oh, but husks might spawn. I think that might be the curse. Husks might spawn. Right, I'm just going to quickly put this stuff away. Uh, do I have cobble? Nope. Do I have any blocks? Sand? You know what? That fits the theme. Flint and steel? Yep, that works. Do I have any torches? Type. Do I have any? Nope. Okay. Put this. Get, need more sticks, put, yep, perfect, that works, going back. <laughs> and now we're going all the way down to the bottom here. Alright, let's see what's up ahead. Okay, see so a big room, big room, big scary room, that's blocked off. Um, I got this flint and steel for a reason. Oh, I love that. I love that as a detail. 
I love that as a detail. Absolutely love that as a detail. Don't love that. Can't lie. Uh, oh. What's this? Another puzzle. Right. I would assume... There's a hopper there and everything. I don't trust this, but okay. Ooh. Oh, I haven't eaten a poisonous potato yet. <laughs> okay. Good to know. Currently cursed with weakness. Right. I mean, if that's my only... Well, if cursed, <laughs> then I'm fine with that. Okay. I mean, oh, I can't take rooms out. I need to come back for all of this stuff. Because currently, I can't take any of it. There's definitely a lot of loot to come back for. And I am going to be forced to do this parkour, aren't I? Okay, well, well, I'm not really forced, but, you know, gotta show my skill. <laughs> oh, wait, it's continuing. Okay. What are those sounds? Ooh! Dice! I mean, I do need dice for some of the things that I wanted to craft. Okay, now this is certain death. I think this is certain death, if I mess up here. I didn't. Get the loot. That's a cake. Never trust a cake. Ooh. Ooh. Look at the ambience here. I love it. Okay, that was me. Okay. Dead end. Also dead end. Okay. I really, really do not trust all of this. Especially the cake. Observer. Hmm. Hmm. And I hear a lot of skeletons. Okay. That's probably a bunch of secrets in this place. But you guys definitely... Oh! <laughs> yeah, that, that's also death. That's also certain death. Okay, anvil. Definitely want to come back for that. Tripwire with dispensers and arrows. I'll take the arrows. That might actually help me in my quest. That might actually help me. Feed the pharaoh wherever he's located. Can't miss these barrels. More food. I'll take it. Right. Okay, at least they don't have bows. At least they don't have bows. Um, eh. Eh. Got it. I've probably been forgetting to turn these on. Ooh. Terracotta. Nice. And I will take these. And I can't break these even though I have a slowness. I'll take it. Really glad I have some building blocks just in case I mess up. Turn that on. Okay, that's a lot of loot. The more stuff here, like, I want all this stuff. I need to come back for all of this stuff. A lot of gold here. Treasury of some sort. Uh, okay. Aha! I'll take all the arrows. And then your trap will be pointless. Haha! -ha. I have beaten the system. Ooh, that's a lot of treasure. Kelp? Oh. Okay. <laughs> this could be tricky. Ooh, oxidized copper? You gotta be careful, some of this stuff could be trapped. But this is some good loot. Really good loot. Loving it. Loving it. Really love it. I'm just questioning where the pharaoh is. I assume somewhere here. Ooh, golden apple. That might become helpful. But yeah, I'm questioning where the pharaoh is going to be located in this thing. If anywhere. If even here. <laughs> uh, hmm. Because this is basically a dead end. I don't think there's a section below this. Alright, let me see if I can swim through this quick enough to get to wherever I need to be. It's just a dead end. Oh wait, no it's not. Ooh, what's this? Okay, I was about to say an empty room, but it's not. Oh no, this better not be a maze. Maybe this part has collapsed. Maybe this leads to the pharaoh. Good question. Okay. This is... 
questionable. Hmm. Oh, I love that detail. The scaffolding is there to like hold up the sand and whatnot. Oh, but that means this can collapse. That means that it's going to collapse and I'm going to be trapped down here. I don't have waste zone. That means I'm going to be trapped. I'm going to be trapped for sure, because otherwise I don't think that would be there. But let's get all of this loot. Not bad. Okay, they sound very, very close. Oh, I'm being cursed with nausea now. That's not really what I want to see. Hold up, I see. I think I came from there. Button. I'm scared to press it, but I think I'm gonna have to. Unless I can go this way for a little bit. Ooh, I can. Okay. We might be getting close. We might be getting close. I'm not even looking at the books. I think they're pretty good, though. I need to remember to use these when I can. There's another button. Ooh. Oh. Weakness. Of course. I mean, I've been telling myself to be prepared that it could be trapped. I'm not gonna take all this leather. I don't think I need it. Okay. Okay. I'm gonna press the button over here. Uh, been there. I'm gonna press the wooden button that I saw on the other side. I think that's what I'm gonna have to do. Probably going to be a bad idea. Okay. Hello, fellas. Oh. Are you the pharaoh? You kind of look like it. Well, oh, hello. Okay, well, the good thing here... Hold on. The good thing here is I am in a place where they can't really hurt me. So, I can use this to my advantage. I'll be right back. Oh, Pharaoh, if you want to kill me, kill my minions first. I am working on it. But it's safe to say, ladies and gentlemen, we have found his chambers. They are slowly falling. Ever so slowly. Question is if there are spawners in there. There might very well be. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh! You have lifted the... I can't read that. You're free now. Eternal slumber. Slay the pharaoh and free the temple from his curse. Minor fatigue is gone. I can do things. I can hit fast. Woo! Mission accomplished, ladies and gentlemen. And that... That hurt. A little bit. Okay, guys, I really want to get in there now. Ah. <laughs> Didn't even get to see. I think the pharaoh was the one with the with the hat. The ye blue and yellow hat. Because none of these guys have had that yet. Okay, guys, please, can, can I come through now? I mean, this is a great XP farm. Not gonna lie. Okay, I think that it's slowly thinning out. Ow. Maybe. Maybe. I see chests. I want to get through. Please. Please. All right, here. Ow. Here we go. Finally thinning the herd. Okay. I think we're good. I can now destroy the spawners that are here with ease. Get. Be gone. Please. Nah. Nah. Uh huh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Eh? They are quite tough with all this armor on. Not gonna lie. But not impossible to deal with. Just gotta get rid of these things. Okay. I think I got the final spawner. I mean, I still hear a lot of them around here. Okay, I kind of like the shield. I might keep one of the shields. As a, as a way of remembering this moment. Oh, wow. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. I might... Go ahead and, yeah, do something like that. Okay. Worth it. Worth it. Can I go ahead and light this up? Yes, I can. All right. What do we have in the middle here? So these are miniature versions of some of the FTB partners. This is Tobias here. Hopefully I'm pronouncing the name right. And I'm Lara. Don't know. Can I pick them up? I don't know if I can pick them up. I don't think I can. Indestructible summoning altar. 
I feel like I've seen the summoning altar from in here. Boss fight, find the summoning area. The summoning area is a rather large structure that can be found in soul sand valleys. And at its center lies the summoning altar. So I guess I could summon the pharaoh again and do that all over. Well, not going to do that right now. We have gotten the eye. We have defeated our first. I'm going to consider, I'm going to consider that a boss. I'm going to consider... Oh. Oh, wow. I'm going to consider that a... Eh. I'm going to consider that as a win. And I would say that we did pretty well. Now I just need to get back. Um, and not miss anything. I want the anvils. I want the loot. Aha. Oh, I thought this was booby trapped. It, it's not. <laughs> it's not. And this actually didn't fall down. I was expecting it to fall. But it actually didn't. Oh yeah. I have to go through this swimming exercise again. Now I can take the brewing stand. I can even take this. And I might take the cauldron. Because it's useful stuff. You know? And all of this gold. I still hear a lot of husks. I don't know where they're located. I might be missing some chambers here or there. I'm not quite sure. But I will not complain. I will get the gold and all the treasure that I can find. There might just be a cave area in the nearby area and some of the spawners spawn some husks in there. That could be. There's the first anvil. And my backpack is absolutely full to the brim, pretty much. Grindstone, can I fit that in anywhere? I guess I can now. I do wonder what would happen if you ate the cake. Dispenser? Aha. A trap, of course. Slowness. Not falling for that. And there we are. The center room. Where I can pick this up. And... That, that has to be a cave in the nearby area for sure. But yeah, I can take these and convert them to ores. Or chunks, I should say, and that's a lot of gold. Oh, hey, fellas. Come down to visit. Lovely. Ow. Oh, well, my leather cap. <laughs> Finally had had enough. That could be what I've heard. Maybe they're just upstairs being angry at me. That could be. I, I had to check what that block was. All right, let's try and go up. I'm not quite done, though. As I do, wanna... Oh, there's a stairway here. Maybe that's the official entrance. Do we have any treasure here? Oh, we do. Wow. I'll take it. I think I've gotten most of the important stuff, though. I kind of want to break into here. Oh, wow. Okay, that's a, that's a redstone clock, all right. Some sort of redstone system. Don't know what this leads to. I think it's just trapped. Don't know if there's actually any treasure in this. Do let me know down below in the comments. But I think, ladies and gentlemen, with that, we have conquered the pyramid. I think this is blocked off. I definitely think this is blocked off. Uh, Crimson? Huh. Yeah, it, it's collapsed, basically. Goodbye, pyramid. It's been fun. It actually has. I really, really thoroughly enjoyed that whole process. Oh. Oh, dear. Uh... I... Where's my horse? You know what? Horse, you're gonna be fine. Sky Village! <laughs> Quick escape! For now, I'm just going to put all of my stuff in here, except for the food, of course. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we got... Hold on. We got our very first eye. The cursed eye, in fact. And right here... Yep, comes with a free... Eh? Too, almost too easy. Yep, it almost was. Uh, <laughs> honestly, if the access to the feral chamber had not been completely blocked off for the husks, that could have ended very badly. But I'm glad it didn't. I'm very glad it didn't. And that is our very, very first eye. Our first, out of many, hopefully. But with all that said and the sun rising behind me, I hope you have enjoyed today's episode. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe if you're new, enable those notifications if you haven't done so yet. And I hope to see you in the next one. Until then, have a wonderful day and goodbye. Yeah.